Hello guys, how's it going? Today's video is about how I passed my Idle Forge Foundation certification exam. So this is for my WGU Bachelor's of Cybersecurity. And I think for this course it's the business of IT application. So this exam is pretty easy. It's there's not really much. It's 40 questions and you only need 26 out of 40 to pass, which is about a 65% or so. So Instead of using the resources that the school provided because they were so dry and I was falling asleep through it, so what I did was I went to Jason D on site and I purchased his Idle Four Foundation certification training and exam voucher. So this training includes the training and exam voucher, and also if you don't pass within 60 days, he will give you a second one to retake the exam. So that's definitely really good right there, and also. This training comes with the cram card, as you can see right here, and also a study guide, which that's a couple pages. But what I did was I print out the study guide, and as I'm following along in the training, I'm writing notes, highlighting things, which is really good because I can go back to it later on and look at some of the stuff over. And also, I use the Idle Ford Foundation vocabulary on Quizlet, which is about 54 of those. So, looking over the, this and Jason Dion stuff should be enough to help you pass the Idle Ford Foundation certification exam. Also, I did purchase the six practice tests on Udemy. I only needed about, I only took it three times here, the first three, and I didn't even do the rest. But that was pretty much it and I think if you're getting at least 85 and up you should be good because on the actual exam you need about a 65 to 70 to pass so that's pretty much it guys so if you're looking to get the idle for foundation certification exam this course right here is a must-have this will help you pass the class definitely because Jason Dion's I like the way he teach and the stuff's really helpful so that's pretty much it guys so for anyone that's looking to study or pass the idol for foundation certification exam this is all you'll need right here and i'll also attach the links to these in the description below and that's pretty much it for today guys so please like and subscribe for more videos and i'll see you guys next time